Yo, what's going on guys? This is Infamous Brand with a brand new video and today we're talking about Ninja Treasures and basically the screenshots that CC2 Stolen 4 people have released out showing us what Ninja Treasures do. Now, in these screenshots, they're pretty cool showing us, you know, different character costumes and different things like that. Now, the best way to get Ninja Treasures and get the items for the Ninja Treasures is to do story mode and they're also going to have 10 Ninja Treasure boxes inside the DLC packs, those whack ass DLC packs that we're getting and um, pretty much you exchange the ninja treasures that you get like the golden kunais, the anbu mask, etc, etc. You can change it for costumes and customization options. So in these screenshots we see a lot of different costumes. The ones that really point out the most or really stick out the most of people that we see in the screenshots is first the pajama or in containment or jail Kaidian outfit where she was pretty much chained up. And uh, we see that in one of the anime episodes or in the war arc for Kaidian. Um, pretty much it's a whack ass costume, but it is something new. It's not like people really really use her unless you're trolling or you just want to fuck around. No one really uses her, but I mean overall it's I mean it's cool that we get a new costume and those are in game and you can get those in game, but I mean Ninja Treasures are whack. We should just get those costumes off base. I mean because it's the last storm game, but it's whatever. And another one that really sticks out to people is the Hanabi outfit. Now this Hanabi outfit is actually kind of cool. And I'm glad to see that actually a new character is getting some new DLC. It's really uh, like a good brush, like a brush. It's really just, uh, a good, something new and good to see. And I really like it a lot. Now, about this costume. Now, I feel like this costume is somewhere in between Naruto, the end of Naruto and Naruto the last. Um, because she has like short hair and she has like this weird costume on. So I think it's a time frame between then. Now, my thing is, if you're going to give these characters all new outfits, I'm going to see new new costumes and outfits for other people like Konohamaru. I wouldn't mind getting a costume DLC for Konohamaru when he's older, like during Naruto the Last. He looked badass, he looked pretty damn cool. I mean, like we're gonna get adult Konohamaru, so at least give us the last Konohamaru, maybe like a tweaked moveset or even just the costume. I'd be satisfied with just the costume because he looks different, so it's gonna be a whole different spin on the character. I mean, there's a lot of DLC they can give us that I really want, but I really don't think I should bust my ass for Ninja Treasures uh, just to get costumes because only way to really get Ninja Treasures is by logging in and playing online, but I am going to do that anyway. So, I mean, I guess it's not really that hard, and of course, by doing the after story mode, the after story, the, uh, the post game, basically. Uh, but overall, guys, these are some decent screenshots, nothing to get too excited about. The demo comes out next week. If you didn't see that video, go check it out, guys. Uh, leave a like, comment, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. This is Infamous, and I'm out.